Buenos días, good morning. Falta un cafecito, pero we're gonna stop to get some coffee, run some errands. I have to work today, so pretty happy about that because I haven't worked all week, unfortunately. But I've been working on other work I do on the side. I do some freelance work on the side, but um, yeah. So last week I was gonna upload a video, just had no chance, and then me being myself, I decided I was like, mm, like I don't know, like I wasn't feeling it, so I didn't upload it. And I was like, well, in modo, you didn't upload last week. You'll upload two times this week. So that's what I'm trying to do right now and get a video out. So FYI, my life is not that interesting. I just go, I just go about. Como llega el día, that's what I'm gonna do. Uh, and yeah, let's go run some errands first at the store some stuff that we need at home and then we will get my coffee <laughs> truthfully i don't vlog i've tried vlogging but i feel like i don't know maybe because i'm so brand new to this i feel weird doing it but i don't know i don't know i'm trying i'm trying <laughs> Day to for the people that don't follow me on social media if you don't follow me on social media on instagram gabby castro music on facebook snapchat everything i'll i'll put it somewhere around here uh, my socials um and also on the description but update on my finger so the other day unfortunately my finger got crushed by a vehicle door and that hurt so so much and it sucked porque me pusieron two shots on my goddamn finger and I am pretty sure I kicked the doctor a few times and I broke Shockingly enough, I didn't break my nail from that finger, but I broke my nail from the opposite hand. Pero I can finally move it. Um, I woke up with a little pain this morning on it, so I put my little splint on it um, to keep it in place. So good thing it didn't break, but I got... Um, but it got really bruised. Um, so that sucks. Slowly, slowly getting some movement back. Um, and then I don't have any feeling on it yet. So, so that also sucks. So that also sucks. But um, my finger is doing a little better. For the people that have asked what happened so I appreciate y'all asking on my socials so I, I appreciate that but yeah I will see you in a bit I'm gonna go inside of the store and grab some stuff we need at home and then I will see you in a bit alright I am back I'm running errands, but time to get my coffee, go home, drop some stuff at home, and eat a little bit of a hat. I'm using coffee. Thank you for choosing the Sabbath. We're going to get started for you. Hi, good morning. Can I get a grande iced caramel macchiato? With one and a half shots of espresso, two pumps hazelnut, upside down in a venti cup with extra ice, please. That would be it. Thank you. 
Thank you. Can I get the, do you guys have the ones without the straw? The nitrolis? Yes. Pretty good. No. No? <laughs> like no. Yes. <laughs> thank you. Thank you, you too. That girl was super sweet and so nice. Honestly, I'm gonna spend like that I drop off stuff and go to work. And Salucita. Oh, is that a bird? What is that? Oh, it's a dog. Ay, por chimovita. Mm, it looks like it's looking for food. Dude, oh my god. Me da tanta lastima ver los animalitos afuera, solos. I just want to grab them and take them home. But, me regañan. Because last time, I started taking dogs home. I ended up with like almost 40 dogs at one time. It's crazy because like a lot of people will say like they've only they've only had like three dogs or five dogs in their lifetime and I'm like I'm pretty sure I've had over a hundred dogs in my entire lifetime and I'm barely 22. <laughs> I freaking love animals, especially dogs. Like uh I love them. I love animals. I love dogs. Vámonos al trabajo. Oh my god! Check out my uñas. They're so pretty. I don't know if you can see them, but they are so freaking pretty. So, story behind these uñas. I had gone to get them done and um, no me tocó the girl I typically go to and my nails look so like I didn't like them I didn't like my nails at, at first and I felt bad because like the girl you can tell like she was brand new you can tell that she like she was new like maybe barely graduated like beauty school and like she was trying and I felt so bad um, but I didn't like them I, I tried like giving them a, a chance but I didn't like them and then I just ended up like going back yesterday like I went back to get my nails fixed and uh, I finally got my girl and I was happy. She always makes me feel bougie. I love her personality, so if you are ever in Bakersfield, check out my nail girl. Her name is Nails by Rainbow, or Rainbow, Rainbow Nails. Nails by Rainbow, I think. If anything, I'll just put her around here. And she works at Posh Nails in Bakersfield on Ming Avenue. Dude. She does such an amazing job. Love it. I love it. I'm seriously not an interesting person. <laughs> So the maximum of units that we can take at the college, it's like 19 units. I am taking 18. <sighs> Plus I work, so I'm already stressing. And it sucks, like, books for school are so expensive. And it's so messed up because sometimes like you, you won't even use the books. 
I remember like I had this one professor that he, that we bought the books and he straight up just was all like make an excuse and return them you like you're not gonna use them you're not gonna need them which saved us some money saved us some money um so dude ex books are expensive and it sucks because I ended up seeing que, que hay unos libros that come like uh, in, a, in a plastic wrap. So you can't even open those. You can't even open those until like you are for sure gonna know that you're gonna use them. Porque then you won't be able to return them because you opened it and it's like loosely. I think that's the word for it, but uh, so much money goes into school. I'm just trying. To, I'm just gonna try to be positive. I've come a long way. Not gonna give up. Guess the último for at least this part, and then I might continue and go to a university further whatever I'm doing um, I don't know it's just a lot of money it's a lot of money and a lot of time um, and it's hard because something like we need to work to be able to survive and then like it it gets hard because at times you can't even work full-time if you're going full-time at school it's hard sometimes and the stress 